Hello, welcome back to the channel. It's Echo Stretch here. In this video, I'm going to show you how we can copy our PS2 saves to USB, uh, just so we can have them all backed up. But yeah, it's pretty simple. We'll just jump right into it here. If we go into our browse option here, and we load our USB, you can see that we do not have, uh, we don't have any option here to actually copy it to USB just not one of the uh, the options that came with PS2 in the time but yeah we can go ahead and use our free McBoot and we can go from there so let's go ahead and switch our USB over to free MacBoot. okay so we can go ahead and unplug our memory card there we can put it in slot 2 that is fine and then we can go ahead and plug in our free MacBoot. this works pretty much the same as if you have uh, your saves on the free MacBoot as well uh, but yeah, let's just go ahead and get that launched up and we'll go from there. Okay, so we'll just give that a few moments here to load up. It shouldn't take long at all. We should have the free McBoot logo. There we go. Okay, and here we go. Everything's loading in. Uh, we're just going to go into our ULaunch Elf. Go ahead and hit X on that. Give it a few moments here to load, it shouldn't take too long at all. And we'll hit circle for a file browser. We have a few options here, or a few uh, things. The MC, memory card zero, that would be our free McBoot. Go ahead and go in there if you wish. Uh, you may have some saves on that memory card. But uh, yeah, that's not the card that we want to use. So we'll go ahead and hit circle. Or sorry, circle on the two dots there to back up one. We're going to go MC1. And you can see this is all our saves. So if we go ahead and hit square, that will select them all. We can hit R1. And we can just go ahead and hit X on copy. Or sorry, circle. I keep on uh, mixing it up. X is usually go and circle is usually to go back. But yeah, if you hit circle to copy. And you can see up the top there, copy to clipboard. So we'll go up to the two dots again and back up one. We can go into our mass. Mass is always your USB drive. Uh, you may see these folders here. They're obviously not on my uh, USB stick. Uh, if we go into DVD, I know DVD is on there, as well as PS4 is there, but for the rest of them, they're not there. Um, not a big issue. We can go ahead and just, uh, if you don't have a folder created already, that's fine. You just go ahead and hit R1, and we can go down and go to paste. We'll hit circle there to paste. And we'll give it a few moments. There wasn't too many saves there, so it shouldn't take too long at all. Okay, and it should be pretty much done there now. Oh, well, maybe a couple more saves then. But it's pretty simple. As you can see, it is copying them pretty quick. This is a great way if you don't have too many memory cards. You can always back up your saves on the computer. Or if you want to download a save, it's just pretty much reverse. You go into your mass, select it, copy it, go into your memory card, and go ahead and paste it. As well, if you're looking for saves, if you go into Google and just type in PS2 save games, I'm sure something will come up. Um, but yeah, that went ahead and finished. Let's jump over to the computer and I will show you the USB uh, just to show you that everything is on there. Okay, so now that we're over to the computer, I'm just going to go ahead and plug in our USB here. And uh, it should pop right up. Just give me one second here. There we go. Okay, and you can see that all our games are there. Um, it did create all those folders. I didn't think that it uh, was going to, but I guess it uh, it automatically does that. I'm going to do one thing here, uh, just so that way I have it done. I'm just going to create a new folder. We're going to call it uh, PS2 Saves. And we'll go ahead and copy all our saves. Just like so. 
This is this is a lot cleaner looking. I think this is the best way to do it. I should have done it earlier to make that folder. Um, but yeah, we can go ahead and just do it like that. Get most of them up. Then we'll go ahead and just drag it into our PS2 saves. There we go. We go here. You can see that they're all there. But that's basically it for the video. If you did like it, go ahead and like it. Uh, if you have any comments or suggestions for other videos, go ahead and leave it in the comments. And if you're not subscribed already, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. But that's it for the video. Thanks for watching. I will see you in the next one.